Hi everyone! So we have come to the end of my second week in school, so let's get into it. This week was definitely better, but not great compared to last week. Definitely Wi-Fi is not on my side. It happened to me twice this week where in the middle of class my Wi-Fi went down and the first time was on Wednesday my Wi-Fi had went down in the middle of the class and I got disconnected from Google Meets and it took about 10 minutes for it to get back up and for me to get back on, which was really frustrating. And then today, in the middle of a test, my Wi-Fi went down. It's beyond my control and there's nothing more I can do than just email my teacher. That's been a big theme throughout all of this is a lot of understanding. Teachers are really understanding of Wi-Fi problems and we're understanding of their Wi-Fi problems. And you know, all I had to do was take a picture of my screen that said there was no internet connection, send it to him and say, my Wi-Fi went down, can I have extra time? He was like, I'm sorry about that, no problem, take the time you need. He was able to send me a new form and give me extra time so I can complete the test and then submit it again. With sports, last week I talked about how the Archdiocese did approve Catholic schools to start fall sports, but it was up to the individual schools whether or not they wanted to participate or not. So my school, Cardinal Spelman, we have decided not to participate in the fall season this year, which was definitely really sad. I talked to a lot of my teammates who were really sad about it, but at the end of the day, it's probably the safest option at this point to not be around other schools and playing games with other people. But what we have done is they're allowing us to practice with our teammates on our cohort days. So this is exclusively for hybrid students where on their cohort days, they can sign up to after school practice with the people from their cohort for their specific sport. So I believe it's soccer, cross country, baseball and softball that are allowed to practice after school. Even though we can't play, we can still practice with some of our teammates and still st stay in shape and play the sports we love. So I signed up for soccer and I know some of my friends, they're doing cross country. So overall, this week compared to last week, it's definitely better in the sense that we've gotten a little bit more used to the connection problems and we've gotten used to how to work Google Meets and, and people are starting to learn how to use maybe two different devices. I do that. I have my MacBook with Google Meets and then I use my school issued Chromebook to do other work so that I don't have Google Meets and work running on the same thing because that will make it really slow. Going into school this week was same as usual, had my mask on. People are still moving to remote learning and it can be really iffy sometimes. Like sometimes on some cohort days, the teachers are alone in the classroom and it's kind of sad, but definitely I can see that as time goes on, we're definitely going to get better with the online school. Hopefully we'll be fully in person by the end of this year, but if not, we have this going well and it's working and we're doing our best with what we have. Well, that's all for this week. Thank you for watching. Bye.